Earlier today, I caught up with Alexis Ohanian, the founder of 776, of course, the co-founder of Reddit as well. We discussed his approach to investing in AI companies and how he's thought about the hype around AI this year. Have a listen. There's a lot of hype right now. Uh, I've been investing in the space for over a decade, back when it was just narrow AI companies, you know, seeding companies like Athelis and Cruise. So this is really now a big breakthrough. Generalized AI is a giant buzzword, but there is some real special truth there. And we're looking for companies that are using this technology to enhance the user experience in outsized ways. It really is as simple as that. Uh, and we're seeing it across the portfolio from AI produced dubbing, like deep tune to uh, sports media right. management companies like Scoreplates. It's not about just the buzzword, it's about how are you improving users' lives using this technology effortlessly. When I was looking through the portfolio, you know, the examples of Scoreplay and DeepTune, you, you kind of split it maybe into a tool, an AI tool, which we call generative AI, mm -hmm. and then an existing technology platform, which is kind of improved or added to using AI. You, you know, explain to us why Scoreplay and deep tune fit those two kind of categories and why you'd invested in them. For sure. Well, you know, as the owner of two professional sports teams, I know how important right. media management is. And this process of actually capturing the clips, the photos of everything happening on the pitch or in the stands, and then, you know, getting those out to the athletes, to social media, to your media partners, that is a ton of work. And software should automatically be able to seamlessly make all that happen way more effectively. But now you layer in AI and you have something that now does it 10 times faster, whether it's identifying, you know, this is Sydney LaRue, this is her kicking a goal, this is the DoorDash uh, logo visible. And so all of that stuff can now be automated away, and so smaller teams can get far more done. And it's not reinventing a whole new technology, it's leveling up existing software that already has deep relationships with customers. And so there are gonna be these types of companies that have strong moats and lock-in that are gonna win. And you know, there's gonna be big winners in this space as well. ChatGPT is probably the most famous one, uh, which I'm not an investor in, though I really should have bugged Sam about that a lot earlier. Uh, you know, I use it to tell bedtime stories with my daughter. Uh, and so you're seeing this very generalized, you know, approach from an LLM like OpenAI that's going to solve a lot of problems for a lot of people, and then much more specific approaches that are solving, at least right now, strong business needs and, you know, offering it like any other subscription as a service business. Uh, just real quick, if mm -hmm. you do bug Sam Altman, I reported last week that there's a tender offer underway, right? And there's pretty big, big blocks of shares on the secondaries market yes. that you know, value OpenAI 86, 90 billion, mm. more than 100 billion in some of the prospectus that I've seen. Mm. Is that a way for you to get in, or do you just you just stay away from OpenAI given its late growth stage? I am such an early investor. I want to be there at the point of inception, all the way to maybe the Series A. That's that's when we like leading and writing that first check. Uh, at this stage, I still think there is value, but it's not you know it's above my pay grade. I uh, <laughs> I enjoy I enjoy being super early and right, um, but. Uh, you know, it's still, it, it's gonna continue to surprise us, I think, what these technologies are able to do. And, and yes, there is a ton of hype, but I do think the sky is the limit. And I've, I've known Sam since he did Y Combinator together back in 2005. And one thing he has never lacked is ambition. And so if, if there's anyone who can turn this into, you know, what all the, the sort of hype is about, it would be him. So a big emphasis there on artificial intelligence. Alexis Ohanian, 776, founder, co-founder of Reddit.